Hello and welcome to another video review by Robin the Reviewer. Today we're reviewing the Tyker camera rain cover. This is the TK007 uh, for digital SLRs but it would probably work equally well for any SLR camera. Uh, it comes in a waterproof pouch with this toggle spring clip as you can see in the photograph. Uh, inside there's some packaging and there's some uh, silica sachets just to keep the moisture down and we've got the cover itself as you can see it's got a longer section on the front for your lens uh, you can cut with a very long lens and arm wrist uh, access on both sides again with elasticated drawstrings with the spring clip toggles as you can see and then underneath we have a double zip uh, these have the nice rubber Tyka zip pulls and these open the whole way across the bottom and it does mean that if you have a uh, strap like I do as you can see here mine's on the bottom of the camera in the center that means that I can do the zips up from either end and still use that strap without it causing any problem so we feed the camera into the rain cover preferable to do this before you go into any uh, any rain and as you can see I can do the zips up from both sides there's a clear panel on the back so that I can still see the back of the camera and you could see on top, uh, which I'm not using here because I uh, mostly do outdoor landscape photography without a flash, but there is sufficient uh, clear housing on the top to cope with a flash gun. So as you can see, I still have full use of my uh, strap when attached. And we can just adjust the front of the cover to suit on the lens. I'm pulling mine behind the uh, lens hood as it's a large wide angle lens and I don't want the rain cover getting into the shot. So once the cover's on I can slip my hands in both sides and I still have full access to all of the controls. I can see the display on the back. I can use the shutter release perfectly well uh, and the lens isn't covered and I can still control the camera as much as if I haven't got the cover on. Uh, what you can see here is I'm just adjusting the strap up so I've got a nice snug fit around my arm and the camera is going to stay perfectly dry even if it tips it down which in this country is not really uh, <laughs> not really uh, any question about that you're about to get rained on. So as you can see the strap is still perfectly usable at the bottom but if you're using a standard camera strap there are clips inside uh, to attach to the camera and then repeater clips loops on the outside to reattach your camera strap too. Uh, so both methods can be used and just as easy as it was to get into it you can just unzip, take hands out under the drawstrings and it's back off again and that is my camera with the additional vertical grip on the bottom uh, it's quite a bulky camera at that and it fits perfectly well and there you can see the cover laid out so it's great you can use the camera strap it's got the extra accessories on the side and great product Thank you for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe.